Hello, so uh, I was outside doing, uh, uh, removing the glass from the window at the back. So I've decided because I have to do the bedroom and I want to start working on the bedroom. I want to clean that general area so that in the next week I work on the bedroom. Ah, which is where we'll be moving into because we need to have at least one room we need to have at least one room that looks good, feels good, and can be used. Yay. Sorry, received some good news. <laughs> okay, cool. So, <laughs> so we're doing, uh, sorry, just a, <sighs> I have to make the room look nice and I want to feel comfortable in there. So I'm gonna make it look pretty um and functional we'll probably end up redoing it later on um or not maybe just adjusting and tweaking a couple of things or adding a couple of things but we are going to start with a bedroom yay and and so right now the bedroom is full of stuff i want to move the stuff that's in there so that i can clean that room and prep it to be fixed up the only place I can put stuff as of this moment is the kitchen and the pantry area because those are the two spaces that have like cement floors and when the floor guys come, they will not be doing anything there because we're going to do something completely different with the, what's it called? The kitchen floor. I think I'll have to first organize it, the stuff that's in there because things were kind of placed just all over the place and make sure that I can fit everything in there like especially the boxes the boxes are easy because you can stack them up and then on the day ooh, and then some can go here and then on the day we're doing it like the furniture can move just outside the door over here um I can have those guys just shift it for me it sits out there as we do the floor because it's just the two seats it's uh, the one that was in the office and that big yellow and Clover's chair, the big yellow Clover chair. have a lot of dust hi so i want to clean out this room because it looks really bad we're going to clean up this room and then tomorrow we're going to come and clean the walls in in the bedroom so i removed all the cobwebs and everything today um that was very therapeutic because the the wood on the ceiling boards the ceiling wood the ceiling thawing they look very nice and clean now so um after i picked up my tools i came and put them in here the place looks completely disorganized and when i'm looking for stuff it's hard to find anything because everything is all over the place now we're going to organize here basically we're organizing the tools because again the tools are all over the place and also just to keep this room nice and neat that way everything is now going to be on this end because this is the one side of the house that does not have wooden floors it's the one side of the house that's not going to 
uh, be affected when we are working on the floors so everything will end up being on this side i have a lot of random things like holders for rollers they're in random carry four bags there's a gunia there's paints i also want to do um an inventory of like the paints that i have to see what i have that can be used as what where as we work towards everything else we're working towards and oh when we were filming Okonje sorry I was doing some b-roll so I just need to let's see I was in the leaves and sorry <laughs> ah, much better so I was recording some b-roll um this morning and I just noticed there was a smudge on my lens just got to Casablanca um uh, yesterday we were here last night. We left here a bit late in the evening. Well, I left here a bit late in the evening and I told you today we are cleaning the walls. I want to clean the walls in the master bedroom because that's going to be the first room we tackle. There, um, I also want to test out the formula that I have done a bit of research about Googled uh, and see if it's going to work. So I'm also going to test it out on like different parts of the walls that have like certain things. I don't need the walls to like be sparkly and whatever. I just want them to be clean enough for me to do a coat of paint to whatever. Like I want to get rid of the greasy stuff, the smoke. I don't know, maybe people here used to smoke back in the day. Whoever used to live here before, I don't know if they used to smoke or not. Like I don't have those details. So I want to just clean the walls. Mm, in preparation for like now that kind of work and then I also have to and clean the windows in there and like so let me show you the things we're going to use we're going to use bleach so I got this Clorox one um if you do not know what this is if you do not know I even Kenyan like I didn't even know that this thing I, like I've never known the name I, I found out the name of this window cleaner yesterday when I was picking it. It's actually called Topics. I, I had no idea it's called Topics. But if you grew up in a Kenyan household, this is what was used to clean all your windows. And I'm glad that it's still in the market because this is what I got to clean the windows with. And then I needed some liquid soap. I didn't want to buy a whole nini just yet. So but this one is the multi-purpose one. So it's just liquid detergent. And then I'm also going to use powder detergent because... Uh, yes we have powdered detergent because this is now for like the container and everything then some vinegar I don't know how a mix of all this is going what it's going to do but this is for the windows it's not going to be mixed in with everything else and then I'm going to use hot water so I'm going to boil water and then the final thing is we're going to use my spin mop this one uh, I had I had brought an extra a clean nini one so this is what we're going to use on the walls that way we are using a clean a new whatever thingy thingy imagine so we're going to use a spray bottle where is it oh is that what it's called oh um, it's the nini so oh my rich sorry i forgot to remove this a spray bottle and then i also have some cloths um for like wiping polythene gloves but I also have rubber ones in case the mixture is a bit too strong I always get a size small for this one because that's what fits 
snug on my fingers and it won't slip i have this sponge thingy the sponge cloth and then i have actual cloth cloth um so i have this new ones and then we also have the ones we've been using um around here that are not so clean so <sighs> fingers crossed that this is going to work out you know as it should yeah like i was giving you guys a chance to cross your fingers that we say yes we can do this but the after actually after cleaning yesterday the cobwebs and everything just doing that with a brush it looked really good and the other thing i want to do i have a i have this brush which is like the soft soft one but i also have the one that's like um for scrubbing surfaces so if i feel like there's sections that need a bit of scrubbing after we spray this i can go in with this and see if it helps or the scrubbing one and see if that helps but you see why we have to do this room by room because imagine doing that in one go at the same time a bit too much work i let me just sort out the water thingy then i show you the ingredients ingredients wow the portions of the products that i'm going to put in this also i forgot to show you the mess i left behind yesterday okay this one i just came with but as we were organizing stuff um this is as far as we went we, we weren't able to tackle everything oh okay so can we not yeah so you usually just dip this end in water and then just spray out confirm it's working so oof, i think i want to start with start with a cleaning detergent that should be enough a bit of bleach this so that it just um what's the word to kill any germs or whatever but not a lot we're not putting a lot of bleach just a bit never good don't go overboard with the bleach and then we can go overboard with the vinegar a bit <laughs> just uh, that should be enough okay maybe add a bit more Oof, I don't like the smell and then now we're adding the hot water actually I think I want I don't want the hot the water to be super hot so I'll start with a bit of cold water um, just a bit I'm trying to keep my ratios okay then I'll add the hot. And then we'll see how this goes now. Okay, so that, that's what we are going to use. I'm like, I feel like all the soap is at the base. Because I didn't, I didn't shake it. I'll just try and shake it to just move because the base is definitely cold because that's where the soap is. Okay, that's okay. I think I should add a bit more soap. Just kidogo. Just. So now the temperature is like consistent and then we'll just put this let's go spray the walls and see what the we see if it's going to remove the dirt it feels a little too big because i've never had a hard time i don't know where the other ones are because this one i bought recently oh wait okay there we go I broke it, I broke it, I broke it. It was too big. See, now it's broken. Ah, oh, crap. Mm, okay, let's see if it will do this portion at least. No! What was making it big? See, they're supposed to be like a one size fits all. Ah, yeah, let's go. So we're gonna start on this. Oh, 
Ah, okay, now I get it. There's one that said, there's a video that said spray at an angle to make sure that you get the right coating and I need a mask because that is strong. Let me get my mask. I picked this one. So let's see. So there's no electricity here. So don't worry about that. Let's see if this I can see the dot coming off compared to this side, but it could be because I think this has an oil based paint, or they had tried to paint over it with like a random looking paint. But here I can see, so I need to just wipe in one direction. <gasps> oh. 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 And I'm just using what a wet cloth with cold water from a bucket. So you can see the difference. <gasps> Look at that difference. So this has a it's like definitely a yellow cream color this is landlord paint of course but look at like just look at where they cut off this is clean that is not just look at that like right and then same thing here just look not cleaned cleaned dope right uh, let's continue I can't remove my mask because of the fumes but we shot um, a new show there's a an episode I think that was shot here and this you'll see it in the show this room was used we used this room the dining room and the exterior of the house so finally cleaning up our blood splatter on the wall I'll leave all the details in the description box of this video uh, so that you can also go follow um, <coughs> whew, you can go follow the the page the Instagram page oh yeah no definite no go follow chatterbox so yeah Katsablanka is in a show and then I also assisted when we're doing like with in the arts department uh, I was Ukoivo doing that stuff with the guy who was doing the arts so that's like I said design and stuff like at least for this place <clears throat> okay so here comes the trailer Kikundi cha majambazi sugu maarufu the Kibiriti Gang wamejirudisha uwanjani. Hii sio Kibiriti ile ya kupita na vibeti ya ise. Hii ni Kibiriti 2.2. Kuna maraka ya kwanza uwanjani. Ground wa kunast. Because I need to leave. What are these guys? Sijikojole. Allah. Bloody gasket. Hiyo tumekataa.
this is a test. How many times in this trailer do you spot Casablanca? Interior or exterior? Yes, let's see. You should be very familiar with this place. <laughs> So either interior or exterior. Tell me how many times you get to spot it. So yay, let's continue cleaning. So this was from that time. Even this, uh, the paint that's down here was from that time when we were shooting. In case anyone is wondering why had I decided to just paint half the wall. I was a little initially before I even figured out like you know am I going to wash them my plan was to do a what's it called a pressure washer like that the one that's used like in a car wash and then just blast the walls and I remember even looking into buying one and all that like I have a bunch of bookmarks I even went to River Road to see what their price point looked like versus what I was seeing online and I spent what like let's see how much like if, if we put a cost um, of the stuff that I bought the stuff for cleaning versus the cost of say like a power washer because but I was like this just took one hour right and let's be honest the first like 20 minutes was me trying to get all the different angles different shots doing a TikTok slash reel slash YouTube short all that was happening at the same time so if you remove that basically it would take one hour it would have taken me one hour to do the whole room because this will probably take like that 20 minutes right and then i only use that one bottle that i mixed so i'm mixing another one for this wall i'm mixing well like half that boat booty i was gonna say booty i'm sorry <laughs> I'm going to mix half a bottle. Um, I don't have to do a full one because I don't think I'm cleaning. I don't think I want to clean beyond this point, at least for, for this video, because my plan is to go and edit this video so that it can drop tomorrow. But I'm so excited. Also because it's the second video of this week. I'm really excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. Ah, uh, oh, the other thing, I want to see if we can do the same thing with the door. The mixer, oh, I was waiting for the water to finish boiling. I had to go get clean water because I've, I've changed the water in the bucket twice. So this is the third time. So I've done a bit extra. <laughs> I've added a bit more in case uh, I am called to do the hallway as well. Because it's not a lot, like here it's just the doors, the doors over here, which the stuff in here, right? And this wall over here, but let's see. Let's see. That was, I'm sorry. That was uncomfortable. <laughs> Even for me. Okay, let's go. Oh, wait, I gotta wear my thigh. Trying to get you to wake up. I ain't coming to wait up. Can't ignore my intuition, baby. I know you're typing every game you try to play You know you could get replaced ay. Cause I won't track a frown, no dead weight Hit up my girls, pull up, I'm outside yeah. Waiting by the curb, too upset to drive it Getting on my nerves, so we gon' get lit on this ride I am so happy uh, if I had my paint with me I would probably be so happy that I would probably have started painting but I have to prep the walls for painting first but the room is so clean even like, like the one that, this door the, mm, 
That one, you remember the random browning thing that was a... Okay. Uh, mm, 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 mm. And I've not even used half the products that I bought. I actually feel like at this rate, I might be able to use just what I bought for the whole entire house. Cause some walls are worse than others, right? Like this, this one, this was the worst door. Cause actually I mixed half of it. Can you guys hear that? Those are birds. Like there's like a whole, oh wow. Just when I'm trying to like give them their props. Birds, you're letting me down. Okay, so there's kids in school, but you can hear the birds. Yes. So, this, I ended up using most of it because I mixed, like, it was till here. Used it on the doors because the doors had a lot of gunk on them, like, and then they had, like, this tiny black specks that I had to, like, really get in there and mm, use my, my wrist, not my fingers. Like, you know, mm -mm, like with this potion. But this door surprised me because I was like, I wasn't sure I was going to clean up. I did not trust it at all, but I'm very impressed. I am super impressed. Even there, where there was like writings and everything, I think if I put a bit more elbow grease, you know, just do it from this yellow and green crayon would probably come out because the ones that were here came out and i think it's because this was a lot lighter but here they had like done several layers which i think maybe i don't know let me see let me see i have a i have a steel wire bit here let me see maybe it will like and then oh yeah there you go it just happens Okay, yeah, there you go. Nothing, 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 nothing will defeat me. <gasps> what crayon. <laughs> okay, so, super happy that this cleaning exercise was nini. It's been about two hours. This, and it's because of the doors, because the doors have the, you see the cutouts? There's like lines there. They had, um, what's the thing? dust that had accumulated like over a long period of time clearly but the doors are the ones that took the most time the walls and everything basically an hour and that was done yeah you know this basically means that i hope that's not the cow that chases people there's a cow here that chases people so i was saying basically this this is a really good start because this is an indication that the renovation work is actually starting uh super excited i can't i can't predict now because i have to decide on what i want to start with the painting or the flooring i i have to decide on that so i can't predict what the ne the next video of the renovation work is going to be but this friday we are going to actually have episode zero which i know i promised in like last week's video but i was my a roll i was very nervous for some reason i was i just I, I i don't know i was a bit nervous making that video so i'll be making another one i'll be shooting that tomorrow morning um so that it works with everything else we have so basically what i'm saying is as you watch this video today on thursday tomorrow on friday there's going to be a video on nothani getao at 3 p.m and fingers crossed maybe we'll have a video another video from like next week um uh like we'll keep it consistent we're not going to skip no skipping no don't skip leg day uh, so like no skipping uploads like that <laughs> So I'm very excited. I'm glad that this room has given me, like it's given me the psych to even now be able to clean the rest of the house because yo, it was crazy. Um, yeah, I, uh, don't forget to subscribe if you liked this video, if you like to hang with me. Uh, this one was more cleaning stuff. I know the other ones were removing ceilings and everything. So thank you for, you know, staying and coming through. If you are returning, 
as always thank you so much for my mvps uh if you are new here by the way subscribe because most of you watch and you do not subscribe and you keep coming back and you do not subscribe that is not fair because why are you denying us the subscription why eh? and you're here don't be in denial you're one of us accept it accept it so um thank you so much remember to leave a comment down below um there's a question i had asked how many times did you spot Casablanca in the in the trailer i shared as part of this video it's a really cool interesting funny show <laughs> i can't wait for you guys to watch it's gonna drop in november and once it drops i'll definitely share all the details about that i'm so happy to have been a part a bird a bird just came and held onto the grill and just stood there and just looked at me and then flew away. Ah! I wish I had like another camera over here like just recording. <gasps> that was so cool. That was so cool. That, that was so cool. That was so cool. Oh! Now that's that's for me. That that's going to give me the energy for the rest of the day as I go edit this video. Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to leave a comment. Don't forget to subscribe. And do not forget to check out Muthoni Guitar, which is my other channel where all the renovation work is actually going to happen. Here we're doing more of the BTS. That's what we'll be doing here. And also the lifestyle elements. So invite me places so that I can show people that my life is more than just cleaning walls. And, you know, I also drink alcohol and dance and dress nicely. And other stories. <laughs> Thank you, and I will see you back here on Monday. Yes, I am putting it out there. See you back here on Monday with another video. Thank you, and I'll see you then. Bye-bye, bye-bye, bye-bye. Have a lovely weekend. Enjoy your weekend. Enjoy your weekend. And I hope you feel the energy from this side, because I'm sending it to you. I'm sending it your way. Sorry, like this room is just exciting me. Then there was a bird on the window. Ah! Today's that day. Oh, that is so cool. And I said it was gonna be a good day in the morning. Said it was gonna be a good day in the morning. Bye-bye. I'm gonna just...